Hi everybody, Pastor Mike and Pastor Kelly. We're here at the Word at One on Wednesday. I'm wearing my maroon uh, GBPC shirt and today we are going to be talking about pomegranates. So mm -hmm. that's why I want to wear this shirt because it looks like a pomegranate. Like and the first time that I got our son Samuel to eat pomegranates, he was not impressed with it. You know, it, lo it looks weird. A pomegranate is a weird looking fruit and then you open it, it up and then it looks even weirder. It's got that white kind of frail skin with those like red juicy juicy things and I said just Sam just try it put a few in your mouth and he bit them and he liked the taste and then he loved that he, he got them so juicy that they the juice started running down down his mouth and he said dad I look like a zombie isn't this awesome <laughs> which means that obviously he shouldn't be watching zombie programs and we failed on that end but he loved he loved the fruit quite a bit uh, and today we're gonna be talking about pomegranates so pomegranates in scripture have several different meanings so when the priests robes were put together when they were uh, woven together on the bottom of the robes they had pomegranates on the bottom because they are symbols of the priesthood they are symbols of eternal life and in the Jewish tradition actually pomegranates are also a symbol of the law it was believed that when you broke up broke open a pomegranate the number of seeds inside those little red seeds would equal 613, which was the number of laws in the Torah. And so all these pictures of the pomegranate are just kind of so important because once again, all these pictures come back to who Jesus is, that he's a priest who goes for us before God, who intercedes for us. He is the fulfillment of the law. He said, I didn't come to abolish the law, but to fulfill it, to live a sinless life. And he is the way to eternal life. So next time you're eating a pomegranate and you bite into that fruit and maybe someone will run down, runs down a little bit on your chin to remember this is a picture once again. Don't remember Christ the zombies. Is. Maybe not the zombies. Maybe let's focus on Christ. Let's How about that? Remember that this is a symbol of who Jesus is, <laughs> the fulfillment of the law and the prophets and eternal, and life, eternal life all in one. Sounds good. All right. Blessings, all right. you guys. Blessings we'll see you, you soon. All. See you soon.